it's a well-known fact that air pollution is a global problem. In fact, automotive emissions, notably particulate matter, were responsible for 270,000 premature deaths in 2013. So, I decided to do a project in the field of diesel vehicle pollution. The devices used to control pollution from diesel automobiles are called particulate filters. They have alternate plugged square channels, forcing the exhaust through the walls to filter out any particulates. However, use of a wall flow filter increases back pressure which also increases fuel consumption. Therefore, for my research, I decided to investigate which cell shapes could reduce the resistance to flow compared to the square cell. So I focused my analysis on close packed cell geometries like the triangle, square, and the hexagon. A filter cell design that has high surface filtration area, large open frontal area, low back pressure, and high mechanical integrity is the best. I quickly realized that these requirements were conflicting. For example, a large open frontal area meant low surface filtration area. Using geometry, Excel spreadsheets, and my research, I calculated key parameters such as open frontal area, surface filtration area, back pressure, mechanical integrity, and hydraulic diameter for each design. Data analysis indicated that the hexagonal cell had the most desirable attributes. However, the triangular cell provided the largest filtration area, with 5% lower back pressure than the corresponding square cell. My triangular cell filter innovation can have a huge impact on global diesel fuel consumption. Since all diesel vehicles use a filter, a 0.5% improvement in fuel economy due to an optimized filter design can save 250 million gallons of fuel per year while reducing particulate matter and saving lives. I shared my research with a filter manufacturer. They built a triangular cell filter and confirmed my analysis results. 